uh, uh, urafiki umekuepo na hatu na tunataka tuhudumishe urafiki kama tunavyodumisha urafiki na nchi nyingine mbalimbali kwa hiyo leo tumesaini hati ya makubaliano katika sekta ya ulinzi kwa hiyo hati hii ya makubaliano itatuwezesha kufanya mambo mbalimbali kama nchi mbili lakini sisi kama wanachama wa jumuiya ya maendeleo kusini mwa Afrika Sadak lakini pia wanachama wa umoja wa Afrika lakini umoja wa mataifa tutaweza pia kushirikiana kwa kupitia mkataba huu au memorandum hati ya makubaliano kushirikiana kama nilivyosema kama nchi mbili lakini kama wanachama wa hizi jumuiya za kikanda na jumuiya ya kimataifa kwa hiyo yako maeneo mengi tunataka tuboreshe uwezo wetu kwa kushirikiana lakini tunataka pia tuboreshe michango yetu katika eh, eneo la ulinzi na la ulinzi na amani kwa kupitia ushirikiano tulionao kwa hiyo sijui kama mlitaka kuuliza maswali lakini kiufupi mahayo ndo madhumuni ya ziara yake ni kuimarisha mahusiano na hizi ni mwendelezo wa jitihada za mheshimiwa rais wa Jamhuri ya Muungano wa Tanzania Dr. Samia Suluh Hassan ambaye anatusukuma sana sisi wasaidizi wake kuhakikisha kwamba tunaimarisha mahusiano na nchi mbalimbali duniani remain indebted for the enormous contributions and the supreme sacrifice made by the people and the government of the United Republic of Tanzania under the inspirational and visionary leadership of the founding leader, the late President Julius Malimu Nyerere, in the struggle for our independence. We therefore saw it befitting to confer the late President, Comrade uh, Julius Nyerere, and the late Comrade Brigadier General Hashim Bita who was the chairman of the Liberation War Committee with the loyal royal order of the Monumutapa in 2014. This is the highest honor bestowed to a foreign national of the government of Zimbabwe. May their legacies continue to guide us towards everlasting peace and prosperity. The people of Zimbabwe will not only remain indebted for the contributions made by the United Republic of Tanzania during the struggle, but are also humbled by the support that we continue to receive in our endeavor to consolidate our independence, our sovereignty, and also our territorial integrity. To that end, we are grateful for the solidarity we received in our campaign for complete removal of the illegal sanctions imposed on Zimbabwe by the West by setting aside the 25th of October each year as SADC anti-sanctions day. And it all started here during the SADC meeting, which was ably chaired by the late President. Zimbabwe and Tanzania has excellent bilateral relations in defense cooperation through an MOU signed in April 2017, which focused on directing staff and student exchange programs at our respective staff colleges and national defense universities. Currently, there is one directing staff instructor and two students in Tanzania, while Zimbabwe is hosting the following officers at, at its training institutions. We do have one directing staff who is an instructor. We also have three students at our Zimbabwe Staff College. We also have one student at the Air Force of Zimbabwe School of Academic Staff Training. Uh, one student is at the Zimbabwe National Defense University and eight students at the Air Force of Zimbabwe School of Technical Training. Today, we have demonstrated that our two system ministries are ready to widen and deepen our bilateral defense and security cooperation by the historic signing of this MOU. I have no doubt that the MOU will go a long way in unlocking new opportunities 
for cooperation in areas of mutual interest in defense and security. 